You know, the district was in a position where we knew that it had been a long time since we were able to keep pace with some of the more modern ways that young people are learning. And for that matter, really thinking about just the way that people at large, not just kids, are learning and navigating the real world. So it became very important to us to go to the community and look for support for a bond that would actually be able to support that. But not only in terms of us being able to catch up quickly, but also just being able to offer more to our students. We kind of lean on this idea a whole lot, but the one purpose was how do we bring the outside world into our kids and what are all the things we haven't been able to already um, bring in and have for learning opportunities for the students. But then secondarily, what is it we can do to allow our kids to be innovators and creators for the future? So we were highly motivated to accomplish those two things and we're pleased that we've been able to begin that path. Another big motivation uh, that our district uh, had in going towards a mobile deployment uh, was just looking at all of the different districts around us that have already implemented one-to-one uh, -one devices within their uh, buildings uh, and, and seeing kind of the, the, the different educational uh, opportunities that are existent to those students that we didn't have before and we didn't want there to be an equity dispute uh, between our students and students from surrounding districts. Really, that, that, that was one of our, our biggest motivators was how can we engage our students, how can we provide them with purposeful uh, and rigorous educational opportunities. Um, and we thought that providing them with the devices would allow them to uh, exercise some, some new uh, avenues as it came to um, the different educational opportunities. We've been very clear as a district about not wanting to become an online school district not wanting to become an online high school, not wanting to become an online middle school, that we really are still thinking about the devices as a potential tool that teachers can use in getting ultimately to the learning. So what we mean by that is that we start our entire approach to the methodology of instruction with what are the targets for learning, and then once we determine what the learning targets are, then we start to think about strategies and techniques that would be successful to create an opportunity to learn, and then and then only do we say, does the computer help us to meet this goal? And I think that's been very helpful to us because it gives our teachers freedom to know that there is no expectation that they're using devices all the time, but also freedom in knowing, hey, I have a tool at my disposal that I didn't have previously. Should it help me reach my goal of, like Daniel said, standards aligned, rigorous, and engaged learning for our kids?